and welcome back to the Railway Men. Now, nothing really has really happened. Nothing has happened since last time. Uh, Cambridge should be Aylesbury. Does the have a tricky game against Bromsgrove? How? Would, what would it tame it? Who to tame play? Sutton Coalfield away could be a tricky game. We've got the hardest game of all though. Peterborough Sports. Whew, it's not going to be an easy one. Uh, Peterborough Sports. Level on points of us with a better goal difference. We're ahead of them in alphabetical order. Thank you, Alphabet Jesus. Uh, don't change a winning side, and we won 4-2 in the last game, so... We're not going to change anything. We're just... Ta we're filling them with horse hope, to be honest. Uh, we're not going to go attacking in this game. Because I'm, I'm, I'll be delighted with a point. I'm not going to lie, I'd be delighted with a point. Like, playoffs is the game. Is the aim of the game, but Cambridge easy game like on paper. We it's it's an important one to win this one. Uh, also, a team you know away at Sutton Coalfield. I expect them to win. So another one for even the playoff chase. We could do with a win, especially as Peterborough Sports are just behind us. Cambridge already leading. They they've won the lead. Let's be let's be honest. They they lost in the last game, but they've won the lead. Uh, please don't concede here. Please don't concede. No. Oh, well, in Stewart, Woodley, out, out, out. Lusamba. Oh my God, you lanky son of a gun. Oh no, ball over the top. Manor, Manor escaping. Manor scores. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no! I genuinely thought we were going to take the lead there. And I'm not watching your replay, you stupid McNish. Go on, McNish. Come on! Big game, big goal. Genuinely massive goal. We're seven points. Samba, come on, don't get counted, don't get counted, don't get counted, don't get counted, Manor! <sighs> Evidently being a problem, so we're going to change it before it causes any issues. Corner, we've not really done much with our corners, but I kind of like what we're going with at the moment anyway. Quite zonal. Uh, offside, great. Went your... I probably wasn't even shot for that bit, to be honest. Uh, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no! Oh. I can't say his name for legal reasons, but... Hmm, that guy has scored. On oh, the stroke of half time as well. Ah, angry, angry, angry. Where's your passion? McNish is the only person who can hold his head up high after that. Let's bring on Kiki. Bloody set piece, uh, it's always a set piece, isn't it? Not as infuriating as. Uh, oh, we needed to win this! Down to fourth. Oh, and the bloody thing has stopped working. That's so annoying. the against column in there. Right, come on, trokey boy. 
Show us what you can do. McNair, shoot. Obviously, don't shoot. Woodley, one of our most talented players. Ball in the box. My bubble! Come on, I think he's been the one complaining about lack of football. You might just get a lot more football after that. Great header. Cleared away, Woodley. I think I skipped Magnus's free kick, didn't I? Header into the back of the net. One more of those, come on. Last few minutes. I know you can do it. I know you can do it. Oh, God. Oh, God. No! Close them down, please. 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 I will go mental if we score. I will go mental if we concede. Oh, Troke's lost his header. Bum. That kind of thing worked when we had a six foot five guy. Up the line. It's going to curl. Man, I was going to get there. Oh god, oh god. Oh god! Oh my god! Get it over, get it over the top. If in doubt, if in doubt, just put it out, okay? I respect that, I respect that. We, neither team is going to score, okay? Please, don't lose it here. We'll take a point back to... Back to but, Back to Oxfordshire. In third. We'll take being in third. We've moved up. Have we? Was it third versus fourth? I can't even remember. No. We weren't fourth. They weren't fifth. Yeah. Say we're staying as it is, obviously. Kempston have won. It looks like. Come on. Where's your whistle? Where's the whistle? There's the whistle. Okay. Happy with a point. We're happy with a point. Aylesbury in the next game. Uh, that wasn't it. Unlucky boys. I just won that day. You know what? It wasn't disappointing. Peterborough Sports are a very good side and uh, happily take a point away from home. They beat us in real life. Uh, I know that one. Uh, they did beat us in real life. One of the few teams to actually have gotten points, three points off Diddy this season. Uh, doing well. Uh, yeah, Alsbury in 10th. We should really beat them. And uh, yeah, I'll come back for that. See you in a bit. Okay, so Aylesbury are on a poor run of form. We really should. We've got a female referee. I don't think. I think this is the first time in Football Manager history I've had a female referee. This is the first. That's cool. I, I didn't even know female referees were in the game. That's epic, actually. Brilliant. What well, good? Do you know, I, I know. I know female coaches are more in the game as well. Like, it's great. And I. Uh, yeah. Anyway, should we focus on the game, shall we? Uh, let's just go. Let's just go. Don't change your winning team. Apart from the fact, Leroy's come in because everyone threw a strop that I basically said. You're not having any first team football. Uh, Simpson, how old is he? 17. Born in 2001. It's going to get to the point... It, it, each year it gets to the point much quicker where people are younger than me. Like the regens. <laughs> the regens we get in this year are probably going to be younger than I am. Mm, it hurts. It genuinely hurts. I'm already looking forward to Regen Day in like March. Basically, we need a win to keep it, in, hopefully, increase the gap between us and sixth. Because playoffs is our best bet of going up, I think. Cambridge is just too good; like they're they're a cheat code. Although they're playing Dunstable today, so we could we need to capitalise and beat Ellsbury. Especially as Tamer winning. 
God, it's high morning. Okay, that's bad. This is the worst half of football I've ever witnessed. Uh, no, we've had worse. We've had worse already in this football manager. Uh, scoring goals is hard. System managers said it not make just get out there and score, guys. Woodley. Right, corner ball. It's getting too the playoff race is getting too close. We when I come back in around New Year We we need to, we need to get a go on a winning run. I said about after this we need to go on a winning run and uh, I completely agree with it. Oh my god. Goal on do we even have goal on technology at this level? No, no we don't. I know it didn't cross the line, but it would have nice been nice to see how close it was. Because it looked pretty close, to be fair. It looked pretty close. Move over this way. Woodley, great ball, great ball, finish, finish, finish! Mmm. Callum Willock's the one who's not scored for ages. The media were going, oh, he's on a gold drought. He's on a gold drought. Like, I know. We're not, we, we're not a free scoring team, as you can see. 23 goals. <laughs> Compared to the rest of the playoffs, it's diabolical. And uh, makes going 1 0 down and giving away silly penalties, you know, even more costly when you don't score goals. Ah. But it was a very good goalkeeper. Not many goalkeepers going to save that, let's be honest. Uh, we, we're, we're losing. This is really bad. Yeah, good penalty. Oh, my God. Four points outside the playoff. That's really bad. That's really bad. How many games? Okay, 38. Cool. 38 games and then hopefully the playoffs. <laughs> Depressing. <laughs> It's really depressing. Oh. That's one of the worst performances we've ever had. Genuinely, like, we did nothing. We gave away a silly penalty. I'm, I'm laying into them. What do you mean you're looking down? As if you don't expect to be after that performance anyway. Don't stumble up next, like, if we're not winning that. Oh, I'm getting sacked. Uh, I'm not. I'm not going to get sacked this season. Like, in another save, if you've not watched it, I might be getting sacked. Uh, no, actually, I'm doing quite a good job there now. I was looking like I was going to get sacked, though, but now I can't turn it around. So, happy days. Media predict predicts two finish fifth. Like, it's going to be close to getting the playoffs. The problem with Lee Morris, he's a goalkeeper, isn't he? Yeah. One for the future. Anyway. I, I know what I want to do. What can I... Uh, we could do Yaxley. Ah, I think we'll do Bedford and Tame next. So we'll, we'll do all those games. Anyway, if you did enjoy this episode, leave a like. Subscribe, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, notification <laughs> That was too loud. And yeah, cheerio. All die verschwommenen dunklen Bilder werden klar Und alles, was sie sagt, wird wahr Ich bin so schön verstrahlt Ich heb ab zum Mars 10.000 Grad 10.000 Farben Bin so schön verstrahlt Ich denk nicht mehr nach Brauch keinen Schlaf Brauch keinen Plan Ich bin so schön verstrahlt Verstrahlt, verstrahlt.